there are tons and thousands of interests, hobbies that you can make designs about. So don't think that the big giants like Nike had made all the designs. No, they can't cover all of this. Can you imagine helping? I've not even heard of this before. That's a whole set of people that have interest in them that you can make designs about. By the way, don't worry. I'm going to leave this in the description below, this list, so you can get access to it. Now, the very first thing you have to do is what? Now, check out this printify.com. Don't worry, I will leave in the description below this particular uh, link so you can use it to get there. But this is the funnest thing. If you look at what's happening here, you can see your design can fit into any clothing, either text, you see, or real design, you see. Anything you can build, you can build a brand, you can do anything, and it's very easy to start. And that's exactly what I want us to do today. Look, it's very, very, very important that you do this to raise money because it's one of the easiest ways to raise money. I'm going to connect this particular uh, Printify to another store, free store, that will give you millions of views. But this is what I want you to see because you need to know how many people visit this website every single month. So you will know the quantity of availability that is available online for you. Look at this now. The volume of people here, monthly visit, is 2.2 million. Those are the number of people that come to this website every single month. And look, this is the most beautiful part. They use almost 10 minutes each time they come. That means they do a lot of shopping on this particular website. And look at the most important one, United States of America. They have over 50% of what goes on on this website. Look, this is the real deal. And how do you start? All you need to do is here, click on start selling so you can sign up basically. And then it signs you up and that is it. That is it. Now let's go through the sign up very easily. Like I always tell you, I love to sign up using my uh, Google account. So I just click on that. You can put your email and password. I'm not a robot and all of that. You can do all of that by signing up. But I always use my Google account. So let me just go in and choose one of my accounts. This is the one I usually use. Then I can sign up with that and then that's it. Then let's go to the dashboard. I will teach you how you can create your designs for free using two options i'm going to use one of those options as an example here then after that i'll tell you three traffic sources that you are going to use now this is not the only print on demand i want to show to you so that you can use and on this my channel here on african giant i've done uh teespring and by the way if you don't know what print on demand is it's just a case of you know creating a design putting it on a text you don't need to sell anything like you know you don't really need to do anything Basically, all you need to do is create the design and the company will put it on the t-shirt. They will buy the t-shirt, they will deliver it, they will do everything. Your own is to just pick your profit. Now, here I say you should describe what best describes you. Just choose content creator and then are you already selling? Yes, I have an online store. I'll tell you how to create an online store. Um, normally, this online store asks you to pay, but I'll tell you how you can do it for free. Okay. How much do you, your monthly revenue, 5000 to 50000 just next to that. This is just for the algorithm, so you can just say anything you like there. Okay, now you see we are almost finishing the registration, but there are five steps here you have to follow. Please stay with me and let's get this thing together. It says you should design your first product. Very importantly, now to design your first product, click on these, okay, and then you can see all of these products, you can choose any. But I usually don't choose all of these because then you have to choose something that everybody can relate with. So I usually choose the unisex Echo Smart, uh, you know, shirts, which is quite very, very important that you do it. Now let's let's use the organic creator T-shirt unisex. I click on that so you can create your first product. Okay. Now you can see it is 100% organic combined rings on blah blah blah. You don't even need most of that. But now there is one small thing here that you have to put your, uh, you know, uh, interest in. These are printers. Let's put it that way. These are your print providers. They are the ones that are in charge of printing for this business. So when anybody clicks on any of your product and buy from this, uh, you know, uh, storefront or the, the storefront I'm going to show to you how to connect with. 
um, these are the people that are going to print it and you can see here the prices the shipping and everything is already calculated here and um, I think that's pretty much it okay now you can see these there is another one here okay I think we should use one of the best sellers basically the unisex heavy cutting tea um, you can change the colors that doesn't really matter you can change the colors uh, let me see this unisex jesse short sleeve tea it's almost the same thing with these so let me choose this <laughs> okay now that's just pretty much it you have to choose something that is unisex that both male and female can wear basically it's very important so now i just choose this and then i go through the same thing you see they have okay i think this is better off because i know monster digital i use them a lot so the previous one i chose i didn't see them okay so this is good you can choose them and then you click on start designing that's how you design here this is very smooth there's nothing you don't need prior knowledge to it and as you can see i'm opening these without any vpn uh, and that's it now this says you should add your design i'm sure you are thinking how do i add my design now let me show you how you can create a design for this fair enough oh, remember i told you about this list and that's exactly what i want you to go through first for example now i want to look for something okay this is recipe creation let me open that and see how many types of uh interest are in recipe creation okay now you can see the history you can look at them just to get ideas of what can you know be made in terms of the text so when you go into each details as these ones you can look for anything that catches your attention and you can use for example now poison catches my attention so if you want to go about cooking you can do no poison uh no cookery whatever you have to be at your best to come up with something modern cookery for private families okay this looks like a name as well you can use cookery uh, poison cookery whatever you know i'm just telling you that but now let's let's do this now so we would understand what i'm driving at if i click on this recipe i copy it i mean to say if i copy on recipe creation straight away to google and search for recipe uh, creation i want to see how many things come out of it okay this is recipe development let me see the searches by the way this is keyword everywhere everywhere the keyword finder you can see this one has 170 per month 180 search per month 180 520 search 220 search per month absolutely this has a bit of traffic it has a bit of traffic and you can also confirm again if you go to ashref um keyword explorer this is a keyword explorer you can use uber suggest you can use word tracker anything you can use just to confirm if this keyword has a bit of search volume if it has search volumes and people are looking for it absolutely then it's worth creating that's how you can go through all of these lists this gigantic list about anything look at this nail art people are here who are nail artists they will buy this product meditation metal art. don't look for the ones that are popular that's a lot of stress. Don't look for the one that's popular. Look for something that is not popular and you can resonate it as a person. That is the source of your success. I spent a bit of time on this so that you will know. For example, this is search, the keyword volume. The, the, this is 13 in difficulty, but 60 people search this every single month. Just this one alone. Now you can look for variations and things that will be more enticing about this. But for the purpose of this tutorial, I'm going to create this recipe creation okay now i know i have my keywords so what do i do i go straight away to my home page and customize my design based on the keyword that i have i go to create design normal then use the highest of that uh you know the the biggest of the of the design template here you can do uh let's do 5000 by 5000 sometimes you can do four five pixel 4500 pixel but maybe 5100 pixel and you can do 500 5000 5000 i hit on create design please stay with me this is going to be smooth i'm not going to waste your time here because i just want to create one design for you so you would see now this is your template this is where your template is which is your canva and then you can see we have made free templates here you can use any of these they are free and all but i'm not going to use any of that I go directly to my text because that's what I want to use. I had headlines. This is a simple text. And then I just put this. Okay. Very smooth. 
so i want it to look this way and i want this to be this way it's design right you can do anything just be creative recipe creation so let me see if i can capitalize this if it makes sense okay beautiful now this is my canva i increase it by the way ensure you use the full space of your canva don't forget the bigger it is the better it will be clearer if you make something tiny here by the time you take it back to where you have to use it on the real place you are going to upload it it will now be very small okay so let me move this one to the middle i centralize that ensure everything is in order now this looks so simple but that's it i i love to keep my thing simple just as simple as this is i will just go there hit on download now you are going to uh you know upload on png and please do it without transparent background these you just eat on download and now after the fulfillment of your design all you have to do is now add the design so you click on add the design it's going to tell you from where are you getting it from my device because i downloaded it on this laptop so i click on that it opens for me then i can go into my downloads and uh, click on this just to upload the design okay then i wait a minute or thereabout for it to upload the file okay beautiful it's coming up very nice now the file is uploaded but if you look at this uh, right hand side here you can see different uh, customizations and all for the resolution like i told you you need to pick the highest resolution so it will be high enough so you can either align it to the left right center you know do all of these just to make sure it's what you want i want it to go up a bit uh something like this let me keep it inside the frame very beautiful that's what i want and it's done so all i need to do here now is change of colors now look i always use dark colors the kind of comma well let me choose some other yeah i prefer colors like these colors like these um i prefer them the mixture of these just choose dark colors do well better than uh, fair colors basically like, like than white basically so i choose um which other one let me choose this one in addition that's like five colors now and then i save the product okay now from saving the product we also now need to connect our uh, account this printify to a store basically okay i'm going to show you that look at this it says allow automated order routing enable auton in this case your print provider is temporarily unavailable due to stock issues or your selected print provider is experiencing similar delays you can automatically enroute the affected items to a different print provider so your orders can arrive on time so let me enable this which is important as well because otherwise if anybody orders a product and your uh you know your printer is unavailable that's going to delay whatever you have to do so just go through these and set the information send orders manually or send to productions automatically uh i think it has to be automatic you don't want to do that manually you know just set all of these to what suits you and then you hit on save very smooth after you have saved go back and connect your store go back and connect your store how do you do that click on my account and by the way i'm sure you have to verify and fill your account in because otherwise you won't be able to do this that's why i'm going back to the source because now it's asking me for my business name and i have to fill that okay and then contact details which is me i just feel that naturally okay uh country um let me choose united states here it's going to tax you so maybe okay let me choose my country let me see if that's available nigeria okay and then we'll see how that plays out and uh, federal capital territory okay we'll just do all of that and i save pretty much good okay now you can see i have uh, created a principal account i've designed uh the first product i had personal contact i should go with the store name which i have to save okay i didn't save that earlier now oh i didn't put this then type in your 
store name let me put african giants okay now i click on save i can save that and then i've done that now i have to connect the store to start selling remember after we connect this store there are little tricks to it and i'm going to show you that now you have to um also drive traffic to yourself so that you can you know make more money very very important so before we connect i want you to go to xt.com and i'm going to show you something this is the store i want you to connect with very very important but then if you are starting directly i'll show you now st shows um, what's, what's going on here st did i got that correctly st google shop okay sorry just <laughs> give me a minute i'm trying to get the right url okay i'll leave in the description below all the URLs, so you don't really have to struggle about anything now what happens on st is a marketplace is a storefront that you can sell as you can see you can sell anything from all of these that we're trying to make and sell from items and gifts and all you can sell here but there is a little problem on st if you sign up by yourself st will want you to pay uh, up to like 20 cents or one dollar 20 cents i can't remember the exact amount now let me try and see um signing up um and i don't want you to sign up directly like this because if you do sign up this way you are going to uh, be liable to pay that money and you want to do this for free so you can't register from etsy front page what you can do is before registration search for on st 40 free items listings 40 free st listings yeah you can see that now item listing st listing whichever one um just search for that all of these guys here they are allowed to refer you any one of them are allowed to refer you and you can now open through them and you get 40 item listings for free and as you can see um they have uh, 40 free listings on etsy if you buy anything from them basically but that's not where we're going you can do this for free look at the description open your st shop and get 40 free listings you don't need to purchase anything you can just open through them and then you have the 40 free listings so what do you do click on this link you can learn more about this but if you click on this link it opens up for you and then you can see um open an st shop and list your first 40 items for free there's no way you sell 40 designs and you would not have made a lot of money so you have to open up through this means okay so i click on open a shop and now you can open up it's way better than if you open up directly from st and then you are made to pay every time so all you just need to do is fill this up just like that you put your passwords make sure your password is strong and then you hit on register and this will make you list at least minimum of 40 items for free which is incredible now away from that you will now have to set up your st account a bit and then like in uh, language shop country um let's just say united states because absolutely you need to sell in us so and it's online so there's no big deal with that shop currency united states dollars okay then which of these describes you selling is my full-time job whatever that's your own edit just fill it up and then shop name is african giants like that i hope that's still available okay i can't put space but i understand i hope that's available check availability oh beautiful it's available now from that i save and continue just follow these and finish up this and let's link this to a paintify then you can make your sales from that. Now that you have set up the account, what do you do? I go back to Printify to connect my store. So now, connect your store and start selling. So I click on connect store, and then this is the store I want to connect to Etsy. So it's going to open up for me to connect my Etsy, and you can see I connect Etsy. Okay, I click on that, I wait for it to link me through. And then it says the application would like to connect your account uh you assign this as this which is yes so i allow for access that's how you connect your printify with etsy so that you can sell your products which is on printify on etsy etsy by the way gets mammoth of visitors every single month 
okay it says success you connected a etsy store check out this article to start selling now that's it you have connected your etsy store and that's all you have to do if i click on my account now then everything is set up you can start selling now from anywhere you are you can see the st logo here on my account you see it's connected to each other now i will make a full tutorial about st and the reason i'm connecting st is this look let me tell you the volume as at now the volume of uh website traffic that are buyers that they get this is 405 million monthly visits so you don't want to miss out on this that's why i connected with etsy and by the way you can connect to more uh storefronts you can connect to more storefronts because there is shopify you can also connect to that but by basically this is all you have to do and then you can keep making uh more designs okay you can keep my store let me click on my store you can keep making more designs and you keep selling i've not published these because i have to work on it based on my everything but then all you need to do is hit on publish here it would appear on printify and appear on etsy if you want everything about etsy and how you can send traffic to it because etsy is a huge traffic source for this but i have other three traffic sources for this i'll make it in the part two subscribe to this channel and like this video so you will not miss the part two i'm sure you want to start this process and you can check back maybe in two days and the second part will be on this channel i recommend this video to you so that you can continue in your journey for making money online and i'll see you in those videos